is up guys i'm so excited right now to be on this camera because in like 30 minutes i am leaving to the airport so i can go to la and i'm so happy i'm so excited i'm so like emotional i'm everything right now and so I don't know if you guys read, but I get like the absolute worst anxiety in airports. So it's not really the, the flying or the planes that bother me. It's something about the actual airports. So not looking forward to that really. Last time I had a really, really bad anxiety, anxiety attack and it's all I've been thinking about. So... I'm trying not to think about it too much and hopefully I just get through this one with like without going crazy so wish me luck guys I'm about to go get ready and I'll see you guys at the airport and let you know how it went <laughs> Feels like fear factor. Uh -huh. It's nasty. Uh -huh. But it's nasty. You want 20 hours or something that's not hot? I'm not sure that that one. Was it even spicy? It's just had some yummy, yummy pizza. It wasn't that yummy actually. I am going to knock out on this flight. I still feel like I can't hear myself from that flight. I hate when that happens. But morning. Good fucking morning. I woke up in LA and I'm super fucking excited. I might be screaming because I can't hear myself. But so like I said, I'm not sure what I'm doing today. But I know we're pretty close to the Staples Center, so I'll probably walk around. It's not crazy hot, but it's not cold. I look busted right now, so I'm going to go do my makeup. I just got off the shower. I'm gonna try to figure out what I'm doing while I do my makeup. So I'll be back when my face is together. And then it says Italian cuisine. Oh, wow. We are currently going to the Staples Center. And I told him it was a 20 minute walk, but it's really a big 30. I was scared of the coffee out here, so I got soda. I'm 
the one telling him he shouldn't be crossing in the middle of the street and I got so excited to see the stable sign at my house who's crossing. So we thought it'd be a good idea to go find a firehouse and visit. How cute. How cute. And we're currently going to Runyon Canyon. I had to change and get more comfy and it's very hot, very hot, I'm hungry. You know what I'm scared of? That we're gonna get, no, that wouldn't happen, right? That we're gonna get off and there's not gonna be a store. There has to be some sort of stand, right? It's a whole canyon. So we made it to Runyon Canyon and I'm, um, Extremely fucking hungry. I saw that. Awesome shit. Do rattlesnakes bite you? They rattle like you move for me. That was the stupidest answer. Jacko, we're about to walk into the fucking... Alright. I need to get there. He wants me to go fucking up there. Do you see that? Do you see that? Do you see that? Just take a fucking... Good luck. Oh, no, sorry. Thank you. Yeah, I don't know if I'm going to go. Yeah, no, I'll be right here, though. So, Joe, I don't fuck with the heights. Use it as, like, my heights. Go that way, Sarah. I don't know. Do you want to hunt? I'm second guessing if I even want to finish. You'll be fine. It's ends right there. Guys, I'm currently having a mental breakdown because I'm stuck in a camel. Look at where I just came from. These scooters are so big out here. And they're only a dollar. And you can pick them up and drop them off wherever you want. Look. Drop them off wherever you want. And it's an app, like Uber. Fucking amazing. And I just paid a $20 Uber and I could have got on that for like five. <clears throat> So I 
ate it already. But I got a cookie, a peanut butter cookie. And then I got some stuff in here. I'm sure you guys can guess. Very nice of you. Very, very kind and nice of you. Now, if you want to impress us and everybody here, do it again! Do it, do it, do it! Man, $100. Where are you from, sir? Give it up for Montana. A real rich white guy, ladies and gentlemen. A real rich white guy. Sir, now do me a favor. Go to the VIP section right there, okay? Go to the VIP section, okay? Because if something goes wrong, he dies first, okay? You're going to be okay. I look like a hot mess, but 
I am drained out of my mind, to be very fucking honest. And yeah, I'm currently back in the house by myself. I just came from the dispensary, so you know what I'm gonna do. And I'm just using this last night to relax and stay inside. Um, yeah. And I enjoyed this trip so fucking much. Like, I enjoyed it. That laundry just scared the fuck out of me. I thought somebody was trying to get into the apartment. It was just fucking amazing. And it was everything I thought it was going to be, to be very honest. Um, if you know me, you know ever since I was a little girl, I've been wanting to move to LA. Um, and I know it seems so tiny and small, but to me it's so big. So... The fact that I'm here is even fucking unreal. So the fact that it was everything I thought it was gonna be is just so much better. And I can't wait to come back, honestly. Um, it's good, but for right now, I'm gonna go and finish my laundry and finish cleaning and I'll catch you guys tomorrow, maybe? Or maybe later, we shall see, but excuse me. Just you and me